you. Two safety referendums were on the ballot. Fort Wayne's passed. A similar one in Bluffton did not. Wayne 15's Taylor King spoke with that district superintendent today about what's next. That's right, Dirk Melissa. Bluffton uh, Harrison MSD says they have are uh, they are appreciative of those who have voted in favor and not in favor. Superintendent Brad Yates says although he's disappointed, he's still confident that Bluffton Harrison will still provide a safe school environment. Yesterday, 58% of voters said no and 42% of voters said yes to their safety security referendum. Bluffton Harrison was looking to add two more school resource officers to the elementary, middle and high school so all could have one. The plan was also to add another mental health counselor. As far as what happens next, Superintendent Gates says the district will review options that they have internally and will continue to work with the city of Bluffton on keeping the district safe. Just won't be adding any additional um, safety elements at this point in time. Um, it's an ongoing uh, review in the, in the areas of safety, and so we'll be looking at internal budgetary items and uh, identifying needs in that area and um, deciding if we want to continue programming or not in certain areas um, within the resources that we have available. Gates added that they will continue to review their pilot program that provides mental health support for all students. And the district will have a decision by the end of the school year if they want to continue with that program with local dollars. Taylor King, Queen 15 News.